Welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge with Beth Plays the Sims. Today we are jumping right back in to find out if Janet is pregnant to try to get the girls to age up if we can. And I don't remember what day we left off of. So let's jump right in and find out what's going on with Janice and the household. Okay, so Janice is exercising. She's wearing her sweat. The babies are doing great. Let's see. Okay, so the teenagers, because they just grew up. Don't you see that yawn, Tatiana? Because they just grew up in the last part they don't go to school today what does it say great ideas are even better when shared with others so she has no school today both of them actually do not have school until monday that is a shame because they are b students they are excellent they've done their homework they've done everything they're supposed to do and now they have to stay home for the weekend so it's gonna be another part before they even grow up janice uh, i believe got pregnant with um what's his name uh, Brandon Akiyama. I don't know why it doesn't. Let's see. New baby from birth. It doesn't show. Growing so fast. I don't know why it doesn't show because her pregnancy um, does show up in the uh, MC command thing. When I went to go check on her, she had a baby uh, bottle thing and a diaper or something like that but let's see is there a bathroom in here somewhere i always forget the upstairs exist uh no there's nothing but if we hover over her and go to mc and we check it here whoops she's pregnant um so i don't know how it's not showing but what we can do is go ahead and see if we can uh i guess the house i can never get it right uh hire a service delivery lifestyle coach yeah i don't understand why she's not showing or anything like that um huh. well let's see what happens maybe the game is still not accepting it or why is there a robot over here and spaceship it must be that uh the kids did their project school uh the kiddos are at preschool they are gonna be ho coming home soon so these girls are basically just you know ready um imagination and i'm sorry if you guys are not on board with the toddlers going to preschool but it's kind of like real life you turn into a certain age and you go to school at least here in uh california that's what uh no no jokesters no none of that stuff um so i guess to Today is just going to be um, trying to get these kids to age up and Potty is a little behind with this kid. How about you? You are set to go and grow up. So as soon as they come home, if he does not have the potty till three, we're going to have to potty, have him potty until he is. Um, Janice, why are you hiding the fact that you are pregnant? Um, she's not feeling it. She's not throwing up or anything like that. So today we're just going to basically is just take care of the kiddos. The toddler should be coming home soon. Uh, so we don't spend all time just waiting. There's nothing really eventful other than, you know, gardening and, um, oh yeah, I got them the, not today, but Monday after school, I believe if they do go to school, let me check it out. Okay. So they do go to school after school. We're going to have like a little, um, oh, Oh, it's supposed to be spooky. We're going to have a little trick-or-treating carve, carve a pumpkin, wear some costumes, and see if we can get together with the uh, the kids. Uh, well, if they come home with an A, then they'll be young adults. But probably have a little party before, and then we'll go ahead and age them up. But I got this instead of um, the... By then, these two should be old enough. Uh, instead of the carving stations, it's just general. Wherever you put it at, that's where they're going to be at. I'm going to go ahead and skip until the kids come home from school to see if we age up up and we at least have some kind of a, an event. I'll see you guys then. Okay, so the toddlers are back from school. And let's see their skills. 5, 4, 4, 3, 4. 5, 4, 4, 3, and 5. Perfect. We are going to grow them up, guys. Uh, Mom, are you awake? You're almost awake. Get up. Uh, let's go here. Everybody go here. Should have made them a group, but we're going to go ahead and go here. Everybody go here. Baby's asleep. So we're going to go ahead and get that cake right out of the refrigerator. I saw it at the bottom and we're going to go ahead and have a little birthday. Where's my cake? Cheese. I don't need cheese. I right here. We're going to put it right here guys all right you are gonna go get Levi 
why not in the middle mom does does it have to be mom or choices no why can't i how about you age sim up is that different no why cannot okay hold on they're probably not here yet here okay now can we age them up okay so what is going on here why celebrate age sim up why is it that the little ones i cannot age up Girls, knock it off over there. Okay, I'm getting a little frustrated because, uh, put an inventory, sack lunch, remove candles, age them up, but it's like you can't age the kids up. If that's going to be an issue, I'm just going to grow them up with MC because this is totally ridiculous on how, see, there's nothing and they're ready. They are ready to age up. So we're just going to grow them up by MC command center in cast because this is like not happening. No, we're not going to play in it. Ask all. Oh, here we go. Okay. You first. Candles, uh, mom. Come on, mom. Who is here? Mom, are you going to come and get the baby? Come on. Number one. Come on, guys. Levi will grow up. There you go. Blow those candles. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, little one. School on Monday. All right. All right. Let's see. Hey, Google, give me a number between one and four. Okay. One, two, three. He is determined, child of nature, and a music lover. Yes. And now we're going to go ahead and... Help blow candles. Asher, you're next. We are going to grow these kids up. Now, these two ladies should have been growing up already and moving out. But I guess their week will be next week. Braley has sent... Levi has sent Levi a gift. Did we name someone? Who is Levi? Oh, no. Did we leave? Okay. And here we go. Another one's going to grow up. All right. Hey, Google, give me a number between one and four. One, two, three. He is motivating. He is unappeasable. Hard to be satisfied. They are often bored and need more source. And he is neat. That is him. <laughs> All right. Look at that. We have, oh, yeah, he's unappeasable and a very focused. Being near a motivating sim makes sims around them get focused okay so i guess her her baby uh announcement is here she is second trimester in 19 hours okay so we're gonna put this away no just um let's just put it away because janice it's not worth it if it has lactate it's not worth it for you so uh let's go check them out in cast and see what they look like and then we can go ahead and get them all fixed up okay here we have levi now uh, I should have gotten a picture of his dad. Do we have a picture of Levi? Okay, hold on. Uh, l l sorry. Flipping over. Flipping over. Okay, so let's go do this. Let's go do this. He already looks like his dad a lot. He got his, I don't know, mixture, I guess, of black. He should have black hair. I don't know why he has the, the, uh, brownish hair but let's just get in there and fix him up okay so this is him without any hair any makeup nothing and you saw his uh dad so i'm gonna go ahead and fix both of these boys they really look a lot like their dad let's just get everything off no makeup on you okay perfect so let's go ahead and fix them up and i'll be right back okay so here are the boys levi is wearing his everyday outfit and his formal little penguin there and his athletic sleepy party swimwear summer and cold weather and for asher our little unappeasable child gonna go backwards we have his cold weather outfit his hot weather outfit summer or his swimwear his party sleepwear athletic formal and his every day this is him and this is his brother kind of two different little faces uh one more looks like i think this one looks more like his mama and this one looks more like his uh, dad and there we are those are the two boys so moving on our kids i don't know why he's wearing that but i'm gonna let him do whatever he wants it's kind of warm today so let's not have him wear that uh change your outfit to every day something i know you might you know 
feel a little awkward, you know, preteens do start to feel a little awkward. Okay, so how are our little babies? You guys hungry? Oh no. Mom, come over here please and change the dirty diaper. You want to donate some money to charity? Are you stuck, little one? Come here. No, you're not. Okay, just uh, go play then. You're bored? Hmm, go have some fun. Go have some fun. Unappeasable sims find it hard to be satisfied. Well, you know what? You're gonna have to find something to do. Kiddos are asleep. These are our two little vampire children, which should be growing up soon. Nope, Halloween. So we still have two more days, or at least one more day before we get a notice. And Janice, uh, how are you feeling? A new life within. Okay, we still have 19 hours before she even goes into second um, uh, trimester. Let's see. What do we have in here? Is there anything that you guys can do to even make sure that you guys do extra credit? Um... Oh, come on, guys. No mischief. Uh, how about you guys also? Let's see. They're classy, so it's going to be a while. Oh, he's doing his homework. How about you do your homework? And get these guys to also hurry up and get an A so we can grow them up. I'm hoping that before the... Uh, Holidays. What was that? Oh, I was about to say, what happened? Discovered un ultimate vampire cure. What? What are you doing? You're doing your homework and you discovered now she can make the ultimate vampire cure on the bar. There is nothing else for Piper to learn about vampires. Why were you even looking at that? Because of your sisters? You don't want them to be vampires? And again, the stars. I don't understand it. Okay, change the baby's diaper, feed the baby. Ah, uh, she's learning a new... I've been doing a lot of research on vampires and hear that there is a way to cure it. How crazy is that? Very crazy because you want to cure children? I don't know. If you cure the uh, children from their vampirism, does that still count as two? Being as they are uh, vampires, whether you change them or not. Um, leave me a comment down below to know if that is, you know, something. Apparently if a vampire doesn't want to consume the plasma of a sim, they can consume plasma fruit or a plasma pack. Okay, so leave a comment down below to let me know if um, that is something that is true or not true uh curing them from being vampires does that um make them a single baby or does it keep them as a counting as two is what i'm trying to say hopefully you guys understand what i'm trying to say here but okay mom more choices you can't do it anymore because you just did it okay um go ahead and feed the baby this is all we do this is this is the 100 baby challenge you be take care of the babies make sure that they get their skills up you grow them up and they're out of the door let's check meanwhile we're checking to see how are these girls doing responsibility and manners are up how about you responsibility is up manners is going up um how about we set the table maybe that might help you if it's not set uh set the table with uh casual setting uh red oh my goodness okay funny conversation go on go do something that you know really matters um hey if no one has told you yet the spice festival is yeah i, I know about the spice spice festival um yeah see but manners so she's got both of them she is super ready it's just um having them get that a until monday is a little kicker um but we can't have any more babies and we can't get pregnant anyway i'm hoping that let's see second trimester by saturday third trimester by sunday so on monday jenna should be having the baby and then uh these girls should be growing up and moving out uh, I've never kept photos of the other 100 babies, of the other 50 babies. I, I, it, it hasn't happened yet. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take photos of these girls uh, right now. Uh, that way I can post them right underneath the fathers. I don't know if that's you know 50 of them. Ugh. Uh, let's see. Come over here and sit. And you sit, and then I'm gonna have you take a photo, and hopefully I can capture it. Yes, and it's a pretty cute photo. It doesn't really matter what it looks like as long as I get the face. Um, oh, all right, you can go. And then um, here, I sit here. Should put it on one. Who's calling you? Hey, I heard you became friends with Tatiana. Yes, of course I did. Um, 
How about you sit over here? No, nope. yeah, that's you. Come here, take a photo. They're all looking the wrong way. Actually, I don't want that one. I want you to be looking a little bit more like towards the camera. See if we, oh, that one's better. Yeah, that one's better. I like that one. All right. There we are. That's them. They're not going to really change a lot between now and uh, young adult. And let's go ahead and put their photos here. You first, since you were the first one born. And then um, you second. All right. And I will fix that up for them. And I guess little ones, put them right underneath. And then the boys, once they come become a teenager, they can go under there too. But they do look kind of like their dad I guess she looks more like her dad I'll be right back okay so we have Francis and Piper right under the, their dad which is we we your Smith okay um and then we have this guy Woot Smith which is their dad and then of course these two little ones are here and she is pregnant with her his kids <coughs> unknown of course I think it's gonna be one because we already have the six <coughs> Plus her. They're doing so much of this mischief that I really, really hate. Um, I'm going to go see if I can go ahead and put one of her hates as mischief. Because I'm really starting to get annoyed. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Let's see. don't remember where I left off. But we've accomplished a lot, I think. Uh, these two girls have to wait until Monday for school. These kids just grew up and I'm pretty sure um, that the kid, let's see. Oh gosh, that's right. They start with the C. Okay, so they did complete their homework, homework. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get some projects for the weekend for all four of them so they can finish getting the best, best, best chance of getting a higher grade. Hopefully on Monday we got a B for the boys an A for the girls and we can start moving these kids up um, and okay again a Monday is going to be hollow or uh, spooky spooky day um, do she have do we remember if we have the decorating boxes so we can decorate uh, outside because we need to do that we need to get this house decorated we're kind of ready in the backyard we have I'm hoping it's not gonna rain on Monday but let's see i don't see the boxes i'm gonna have to buy the boxes and decorate the house but let's go ahead and do that before we leave i really thought we had some i really 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 thought we had the decorative uh box thingamajigger but i don't see it um it would have been somewhere in some kind of little corner Obviously, it's not. And now the boys have graduated to their rooms up here. They can go to sleep in any of those beds. It's up to them. They get first dibs before any other little boys come into this home, which will be a while. They'll probably be moved out before then. But let me go get the boxes and we'll decorate. Okay, let's go ahead and just... Um, oh, no, no. Go back to live mode. And we're going to have Janice come over here and select every day. No. Oh, God. Gosh, it has to be spooky thing to decorate. Who decorates on the day of? You're supposed to decorate like days ahead. Oh, uh, no. I'm not happy about this. I wanted to decorate it today and then I have to decorate. Every Let's just go ahead and at least decorate. Um, decorate. Select every day. No, no, no. Rummage. No. See, it won't even let me. Rummage for summer decorations. No. Okay. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get. Can I still do it or is it too late? Add an event? No. Nope. Okay, we'll just do it for tomorrow. Hollow. I'll just put um, decorative day. I love the activities for school. Um, let's see. Where is... Yeah, there you are. No, we're not baking a cake. Okay, we are going to go ahead and decorate for spooky fast. Uh, spooky and then just decorate. No big deal. We'll decorate for tomorrow and that's it. But for now, guys, I'm going to end it here. We did get a lot done. We are in the waiting process of the girls getting an A on Monday. The boys getting a B growing at least the girls up. I'm hoping that with the boxes that I plan to get for them, the uh, projects, that they will get a little head of 
the game. Uh, they do have this. The homework is complete. And then getting a little bit ahead. By Tuesday, I want to say by Halloween. Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday or Wednesday. They should have an A. We could throw them up. And then I'm hoping that by next Friday. Friday we have them oh, sorry guys um by next Friday they will be grown up to uh young adults I'm pushing it but I am really trying to get through this challenge I want to get the challenge done before March 1st which doesn't give me a lot so you might be seeing more uh videos of the 101 baby challenge in the next month in February maybe two 100 babies on Mondays and Fridays and then Wednesdays will be the legacy and then I can finish that off by March the 1st that is my goal March the 1st to finish this one so more videos coming for the 100 baby challenge I see that you guys are really enjoying the 100 baby challenge as I see the numbers going up I appreciate you guys so much thank you guys for the 100 uh, subscribers I really really appreciate that Love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next part. And if you guys are interested in the Legacy Challenge, Evelyn Greenberry, bye for now.